Adam, I want to start by asking you about the instant right at the end of the game. When you see Marcus took a three, four yards from goal, do you think that's the point's gone today? Very much so, yeah. My heart was in my mouth, I think. And uh, that would have been a bit of a signal, really, because um, I think they were rather fortunate for it to kind of ricochet into his path, which would have been a disappointment. But it was, it was nice to get a bit of stroke of luck, really. Um, but we can't really keep relying on, on luck because I think they had probably won too many looks at our goal um, for my liking really today and on another day they perhaps put one in but thankfully they didn't so we'll take the positives and we've got a clean sheet which um, is a good thing for us to build on obviously we didn't get the win and it's a little bit disappointing that we didn't because obviously we're chasing those top two but um, if we can win next week against Sheffield United, it could be a good point. Mm. Um, I mean, the manager said to us this week that he's not too worried about performances, it's about points now until the end of the season. Of late, this five games unbeaten has, has really been down to defensive solidity since you've come into the side. Well, now the lads have, um, you know, been, there's a great group here, to be fair. And I've, I've walked into the dressing room, and that's one thing that strikes you straight away. And they all work so hard for each other, you know. So from 1 to 11 and throughout the whole squad, it's. It's really a, a pleasure, really, to to walk into the, this kind of dressing room because they're such a great group. You know, they're a lot of great characters and some really good players in there. So it's uh, it bodes well for the future, really.